Blessings, blessings to you blessings. guys. God bless you all. Yes. We have something that we want to share with you guys. Yes, I think it's important to show this because we need to be alert on the serpent's tongue. Yes. You know? Mm -hmm. So let's watch it and then we'll uh, talk more about it. In London and we thank God for the opportunity to be here. I'm joined with my beautiful wife and it's going to be an amazing time in the presence of God. And um, this has been truly, um, it's been truly a desire of ours, but we've waited on God to give us the direction and, and the way we should go in order for us to, or to carry out His will. And uh, we thank you all for being here and even those who are watching online, but especially those who are here because we don't get to see you. But, We are, we are going to have a good time today. We're going to learn a lot, and I am excited about Friday. And um, it, will be, it will be phenomenal. We will see the Lord in, in all his glory. Now, today, I want you to be ready. Um, whenever you listen to me, make sure you have your notebook, because sometimes we delete things, not because they are wrong. Uh, we, we delete things simply because of one thing. Some people are not mature enough to receive what is being said. And you have to understand that. I, I'm going to explain something. I'm going to give you a small disclaimer as we go in. And this is not to defend anything, but I want you to understand something. There is no such thing as evil knowledge. Knowledge is just knowledge. What you do with it determines the outcome. But knowledge is just knowledge. An example is... The tree of knowledge of good and evil was not a bad tree. God has never planted anything evil. The problem is whoever acquires the information, are you mature enough to govern it? If you have no ability to govern it, then you can end up perverting what should be pure and what should be good. This is what happened to the devil. The Bible says you corrupted your wisdom, but there is no bad wisdom. Are, are you understanding what I'm saying? The knowledge of God, there is nothing God created that is evil because God is not a God of evil. Evil is a perversion of the revelations and the truths of God. That's all evil is. This, uh, this, man, this man has a cunning spirit and is very, very dangerous. Very dangerous. Very dangerous. It's just... It's, it's very dangerous, y'all. He, he sounds so, he, he comes off like he's so intelligent. Yeah. And he knows how to pull people in. And if you're not strong enough, it's not good to watch him. It's not. Because he'll pull you in. And if you're, very, if you're a very weak, um, you know, believer, yeah. please, you know, be careful with him. Mm. Okay? Man, mm. I, I, I listen to him. And um, as of right now, the way he said that he delete his videos I, and I delete them because people are not ready to hear the knowledge. What, the knowledge God is giving you for the world wow. or just for particular people and that woman that are writing down. This is the, the thing that we always want people to just make it make sense. Yeah. You delete uh, store like things because you already know that you have bewitched these people this day. Then you don't want people like us to see the bewitchment. That's it. So you just go ahead and delete the, the, the so-called heavenly or prophetic teaching that you made that the whole world need to see. Mm -hmm. So what is that telling you? There's a lot of people. That, they all, you see how he said it? Pro, uh, people that are not matured. Yeah. So that he know that is, there will be some people that will listen to this garbage and with such scriptures. He's making them feel good. With this why here talking about, you know, some people are not mature enough. He's making his audience feel good. Like they are mature. So when, 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 we, when we and everyone else come against him, mm. um, he's you know trying mature. to belittle us. Yeah. yeah. So his followers don't listen to us. Listen, mm. Lovi, I'm going to tell you something. You and your wife and the rest of y'all, Passion Java and Lily Java, we see y'all. Mm -hmm. we, we, and you know it. You know that we are truth and you can't stand it. Yeah. Because we know why you're really here. Mm. 
Okay. I know that you have a serpent tongue and we're going to stay on top of you. Yeah. Okay. And the truth will definitely end up coming out. You know, a lot of people always say, man, you, you know, you're exposing these people and they're still growing. I always tell people this. Mm -hmm. Scammers that are not even believers. Scammers out there. Big scammers are still progressing. They are. Even in, the, even in the government leadership, there's still a lot of them. They're still progressing. Even in your country, that, that leader that are, you know, defrauding and taking all the money away from people, not even building roads and construction, they're still progressing. So stop thinking, oh, God is going to do it right away. No, God mm -hmm. want to wake people. Some people, when Jesus Christ came, it, it was some people that Jesus Christ was assigned to wake them up yes. so that they will see. Ezekiel in the Bible, God used him to wake people up. Mm -hmm. But if you still want to keep on following the idol way or shrine or native doctor or all these witches and wizard, mm -hmm. uh, palm readers, it's up to you. But there is some people that still need to wake up from any, any good thing that they receive from the new people that are speaking and calling this evil out. Please read Matthew 24, the whole chapter, because we need to know that uh, we need to know the season and the times that we're living in. This yeah. is the times that a lot of false prophets are going to rise up and it's going to, and uh, it, the Bible says the very elect will be, will be deceived. deceived. Mm -hmm. They're going to do signs and wonders. They're going to talk so good. But you have to be alert. You yeah. have to stick to the word of God. And I listened to this program. I listened to this uh, program the much as much as I could because mm -hmm. I ain't got time to listen to all of it. I got a life. OK, yeah. but the way uh, even the title long is off powers and stars, crystals and precious metals reveal live in London. Dr. Lobie. Now that right there <laughs> is off and weird. Okay, mm. because we need to know the 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 uh, the power of the demonic tongue. Yeah. If you you don't have the wisdom to realize that this is a serpent tongue trying to come in and to destroy the body of Christ, then you need to go into prayer more and ask the Lord. If you think that we are haters of lovely, no, we were trying to wake y'all up. Go into prayer and ask the Lord. What is the true heart of Lovi? Mm. The true heart of his ministry. Ask the Lord the true heart of Henry and Monique. God will show you the truth. This man was on here talking, like my husband, go ahead and tell him about how they go back, back and forth with the Old and New Testament. Okay, yeah, because uh, I, I saw a video that he was teaching people that we are no more under the law of Moses, like that area. So the grace of Jesus Christ has come in, right? Mm -hmm. So you see how they will neglect scriptures of Old Testament, then pick the grace, yes. right? But when they want to present their witchcraft teaching, they go back to Old Testament. Mm -hmm. So why can't you use the whole scripture right. to help people out? Mm -hmm. Instead of choosing on this area about grace, then you, you condemn the... The, 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 because people will go to hellfire if they are com if, if they are staying in their sin. So you see how they mix yes. the whole scriptures. Yes. So with this teaching, he's he's talking he's talking more in the Old Testament and um, how he he uses um, how the Lord, uh, you know, built built you know sapphire and the stones and all this with the with the temple and all this. You know how. That's what. Listen, we use wood and we use stone in our kitchen. We use wood to build. We use concrete to listen. We use those stones. OK, now what's it have to do with salvation, though? Now, what he is doing is he's manipulating it, yeah. talking about you can use this stone and you can put power in it. So that's the manipulation that he's doing. OK, mm -hmm. so I want everybody to know. Be very careful in this teaching very because good. it is very simple. Mm -hmm. uh, we say it on these videos all the time. Prayer, fasting, living holy, having faith, believing in Christ mm -hmm. Jesus. 
That's all you need. That's you don't need and the stones. Extra thing. You don't need sage. Or, or prayer you don't need for uh, one in a bind. You don't need the, the credit card for one in a bind. Yeah, you don't, you need, don't all need all of that. You don't need all that. It, like, it don't need and all and that. he was saying that, you know, everybody's calling everything witchcraft nowadays. Let me tell you but, something. But we know by their fruits we shall know them. Test the spirit. That's what the Bible made us to understand. And, and we have to call it out. And let me tell you, and, and he's talking about the, the stars and all this other stuff. Listen, we don't need the stars. We don't need stones. We don't need um, any of this to serve Jesus Christ. Mm. We don't need any. None of this mm. helps us with salvation. None of this will help us heal because a lot of people use crystals to say that it, it, it takes away demons using salt. It takes away demons. Now we got to be very careful because I know this is what he's leading to. Now yeah. he might not say it, but this is what he's leading to. Mm -hmm. We got to mm -hmm. be very careful. Mm -hmm. Man, Satan, so, is, Satan so is something else, man. Why, why, why did Jesus Christ die then? I'm telling you. If we go, if we would go back to crystal, all this, uh, all this, all that, why do we? What's the need of the? What bed? is the need? Wow. Let me read this real quick, and we're gonna move on. Now the serpent was more crafty than any of the wild animals the Lord God had made. He said to the woman, "Did God really say?" You must not eat from any tree in a garden. The woman said to the serpent, we may eat fruit from the tre uh, the trees in the garden. But God did, did say you must not eat fruit from the tree that is in the middle of the garden and you must not touch it or you will die. And then it says you will not certainly die. The serpent said to the woman. For God knows that when you eat from it, your eyes will be open and you will be like God, knowing good and evil. Mm. You see how the serpent mm. was was convincing her to step outside of the will of God. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So this is what Lovey Lovey has done this a lot. I just wish that some people will wake up, you know. That's why we have to, we have to, well, we got to stay on point I know. when it comes to um, who we listen to. This is yeah. crazy. This is wild to me. This is dangerous. In my day and time, mm -hmm. in our day and time, mm -hmm. seeing this type of preaching is very dangerous. I, I would have never uh, thought that I would see something like this. And he's the same person that collided with uh, Pastor Java to ask women to sow seed for them to get married. And after sowing seed of $1,000 to get married, he still tells them to go home and use water from, the, from, their, from, from their kitchen or anywhere there is running water mm -hmm. to wash their face seven times. That's the same, pe like, what is all this garbage coming from? This is crazy. What is this all about in the body of Christ? Mm -mm -mm. What is this? No, not the body of Christ, body of church. What is mm. this? Mm -hmm. People of God, please heed to the warning. Stay away from the people like this. We know time will come. We're gonna receive a lot of emails and messages. We are uh, listening to yours video a long time ago, but I, I I didn't know any better. But now, now, now I get it. Time is now for you to begin to really think for yourself, please. study for yourself. My people perish for lack of knowledge. Please, please. We love you guys, and that's why we're bringing this with yes. love. Love it. We love you. We need your repentance. We, you know, we're sincerely praying for each and every one of you. All these people that we call out, we're praying for you all. Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you for watching. We love you guys. Bye. Bye.